Hello everyone, welcome to Electric Vehicles and this is Pawan, Pawan Kumar. Yesterday, Tata has launched its most awaited electric car, Tata Tiago EV and we have already made a video on that. If you haven't watched that video, I'll give you the link in the description. Please go and watch that. And coming to this video, this video is like an opinion video on Tata Tiago EV. Now, Mr. Anirudh is with us. Actually, he's the owner of Tata Nexon EV Prime and he has already given his review on that car. We have already made a video on that. I'll give you the link in the description of that video also. After this video, please go and watch that. Okay. Now, uh, hello, Mr. Anirudh. How are you? Hi, doing good. How about you? Yeah, I'm fine. So, Yesterday, Tata has launched its uh, most awaited electric car, that's it, that is Tata Tiago EV, after yes. a long time. Yes. So, what's your first impression on that? Uh, first imp impression, first opinion is, first, I was surprised. Okay. I, I, in my uh, uh, like heart, like I thought I should have waited at least uh, right now so that I can get that opportunity to uh, grab that uh, car in such low price. Okay. If you uh, see the price, it's very attractive and uh, it's very compact car. So, you can keep that car as your secondary car and uh, keep another car as a uh, fuel car uh, for yes. highway driving that is what uh, that was my intention uh, but uh, un unfortunately i missed that opportunity to okay. take that uh, car but i am so thankful to uh, tata uh, people uh, that they uh, they have allocated 2000 vehicles for yes. especially for ev car owners who want to uh, choose that car as a second uh, car in their home yes that so, is very good. Yeah, I also like that part, like uh, it reserved 2000 units for exactly. existing customers so that they won't be regret later. Yes. So that's a good part. And, and will you take it as an alternate car for your Tata Nexon? Yeah, and obviously. Yes, obviously, if it is coming between below 10 lakhs, mm -hmm. then it is worth. Uh, so whatever uh, which you are investing, uh, so you can easily recover and uh, it's, become, it's a small car. Yes. Uh, you know, India is uh, like uh, all, like you can even take it to small uh, lanes and other places, wherever you want. Where It's like a, uh, just like a small Alto. You can assume it like an Alto, where you can simply take anywhere, any, uh, any place. And uh, there is no kind of... Uh, this one like you can every time whenever we post an uh, ad or anything, we say to people they only say price is our concern if a uh, Tata or yes. any other manufacturer comes with that price mm -hmm. like we thought it for 10 lakhs yeah. but uh, Tata surprised it for like uh, first 8,000 uh, units for outside people who uh, the, I guess the bookings will be started from December uh, and uh, the uh, sales would be uh, going from january of 20 uh, next year so if we can go ahead and uh, take it uh, since that's a good opportunity by uh, everyone so uh, it's a lot of uh, people might be waiting for any car which comes below that price yeah. and uh, they are even uh, looking for an alternative car since they want to buy it but uh, thinking of the budget they will uh, drop it but there's the right opportunity best uh, uh, time to take that car at uh, since tata had launched it uh, at very less price even if you see in the market, there is no other car compared to that price and that features. If you yes. see the features, there are too many features given to that just like Nexon. Yeah. Even I feel that now, whatever I kept for this car, uh, that would be same features would be given for less price. Yes. So as an Indian customer, price concern would be the first point. So in that case, obviously, that is the best car since a smart connected car. Yes. And even you'll be getting some, uh, road, there is no road tax, no registration charges in our Telangana, Hyderabad, uh, state mm -hmm. and uh, even you can go and uh, try to uh, uh, do a test ride so that you can understand even our, my friend was planning for an, uh, that uh, tiago uh, base uh, like top end automatic model when we checked the prices it were around uh, eight and a half lakhs uh, or nine lakhs uh, top end variable for automatic uh, with that price we are getting the same uh, ev car with an automatic yeah. That is more yeah. attractive and yeah. even uh, in the ad of the Tata, we can see clearly that whatever the knob uh, features and everything, all options with the region buttons were given in the car. Yes. So I think that is very truly uh, impressive to customers and the uh, only thing is we have to get uh, reviews from users about the real time range. Yeah. Since uh, as per me, there are two ba battery packs, one is uh, 20.4 kilowatt and the other one is 19, 19. 19 kilowatt. So I guess 24 kilowatt might give around uh, 250 to 220. That is what my guess, but we have to check it out. Yeah. And the other one might give you around 150 to 200. That is what I'm, I'm assuming that. Uh, and uh, there are a lot of color options and uh, that is the best part. And even we can assume that in future, uh, if Tata permits a lot of users to get it converted to an uh, electric car, like uh, get your uh, petrol or diesel yeah, car and, and exchange the engine and uh, pay the extra, extra amount to 
change it to motor and uh, battery that would be much uh, better for existing users that would be more uh, reasonable for everyone to get converted yes. okay okay actually we are having uh, trims like various trims we are actually having seven trims and the base uh, the base model would comes to 8.49 lakhs it's almost 8.5 lakhs and the top end will be 11.79 that means 11.8 lakhs exactly and for base model we'll be having a, a claimed range of 250 kilometers and for top end it will be almost 315 kilometers and do you think really it's uh, really it's worthy to buy that car with that amount of money for that much of range so based on your requirement if my surgeon is first go and uh, test it, uh, test ride the car if you are a single hand per, a single hand like if you go singly and everywhere highways and, and other places uh, and within city if uh, you are traveling is within city and daily 200 kilometers that is the best car since with that price whatever the investment you are doing i am sure that within 4 uh, to 5 years you'll be getting that investment back yes with that uh, assume that even if a person uh, daily commute commute is 200 kilometers he can easily recover his entire money within 4 uh, to 5 years yes. and uh, after that he can uh, use it as a secondary car but right now that is a golden opportunity again we don't know the prices might change depending upon the international uh, uh, battery rates and other stuff but uh, uh, if you want to uh, give a uh, goal or any uh, trend to others like if, if what is my suggestion is for if you are planning to take an uh, second vehicle with that budget go for this uh, tigor ev and uh, you can use your uh, old car petrol or diesel car and as well as this ev car uh, and uh, you can show others uh, that this is the less price and these are the benefits and these are all the features coming in this car since with this price nobody is giving such uh, features in any of the segment okay. that is what the tata is uh, planning uh, even every whatever the prime features are there cruise control everything has been included in this uh, tigor ev uh, the company has announced that there is an option for this car to like for multiple uh, battery and charging options and do you really think customer can opt a suitable one for him like do is it really good option so right now if it is only for a city commute even i am doing most of the time city commute uh, for city commute you don't require any fast charges mostly you can keep it your friends neighbors or your home if only thing is if you are not uh, if you are planning for a highway then uh, the fast charging comes into the picture so right now uh, it's not at all required but uh, if in case if you are planning then you can just uh, take a kit uh, travel kit like you'll get a cable uh, uh, length of uh, 40 meters or 50 meters that that's ma manageable that's not at all required only thing is uh, it's compact so you can't uh, five people can't uh, i guess uh, since in the back I, we don't know whether five uh, three people can sit at the back uh, seat or not so that we need to concentrate and what about the luggage and other stuff yeah. so i have, I have a doubt that uh, how is the boot space compared to the petrol variant and diesel variant so once uh, they give it uh, for uh, real time Uh, test ride we can then analyze everything what are the benefits and everything but it's really worth and a uh, lot of users don't know that T tata tiago have launched that with that price mm -hmm. so with your channel what i recommend you to do is even uh, after the after our last video uh, another person had uh, one at one place uh, i met with another person he was asking uh, you are from the uh, ev uh, channel right yeah. yeah i told yes uh, okay based on your inputs and everything feedbacks i bought an other new car and he i was so surprised oh it's really good since uh, we are uh, saving uh, environment that is our main goal uh, so go green uh, and uh, even uh, the consumption of fuel is very less uh, i mean say uh, the uh, the fuel uh, so if you calculate with this uh, car or uh, tigor or anything uh, the consumption of uh, fuel prices and uh, battery is a uh, very huge difference there's a huge difference so example if you are going for 500 kilometers on electric car the cost would be around uh, uh, hardly 150 or 200 rupees if that is the same case for petrol car or diesel car it would be around 3 to 5000 rupees so there's a lot of difference and uh, even companies are uh, a lot of mnc companies are nowadays uh, uh, giving that opportunity to take an ev car so that they can uh, redeem the electricity bill yeah so uh, you can go ahead and opt it that is what my suggestion is right okay and in yesterday's uh, launching video mr silas chandra he is the md of uh, tata electric mobility he said that uh, a tata tiago ev customer can save up to 6500 rupees on fuel expenses for every 1000 km exactly he he stated that so really 
could we save that much of uh, money on uh, fuel expenses exactly we can save even more, more than that but the only thing is uh, we have to uh, uh, so the, the the car is meant for the people who roam a lot okay if you assume that the daily travel is around 500 kilometers or 400 kilometers mm -hmm. then they can recover uh, recover that price and even i was surprised that first tata had showed an altro as a prototype everyone yeah. were thinking that altros would be the next uh, low car uh, yes. with low price but all of a sudden they have uh, launched that small car though that is very impressive compared to Altros. After publishing Tata Tiago EV cars uh, video on yesterday, we got mixed mixed comments like some positive and some negative. Uh, like negative comments are stating that 8.5 lakhs is very expensive for this car as it is having only 250 kilometers range and it's it's uh, 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 speaking frankly it's very hard to get that kind that much of range when we are in commute purpose so wh what's your thought on that so if you think uh, the cells are not manufactured in india right now mm -hmm. and uh, even it's uh, almost uh, the taxes on the cells uh, were very high mm -hmm. so if you take the uh, entire whatever the ev car almost 70 to 60 percent of bat uh, the vehicle price would be uh, given to the battery mm -hmm. so that is the main thing uh, which government is already uh, trying to um, co uh, coordinate with other manufacturers like Amron, other Excite and other. They are trying to uh, make the cells. Mm -hmm. So once the cells uh, assemble would be done in India, mm -hmm. I am sure the prices would be less. C uh, don't think about the prices. Think about the investment which you are giving, going to keep you know, for fuel service and other cost in future. Even if you take a small car, if you uh, assume that if you have uh, the overall uh, uh, reading is of the car is 1.5 lakhs mm -hmm. so you would be invest is investing around uh, i'm sure that uh, more uh, 5 lakhs yeah so come so this is one time investment yes. and the service cost there's no maintenance nothing and uh, ease of charge that is uh, much better so you don't know so only thing is if you want a clear idea how, how does this calculations works go and uh, check with your neighbors or friends who already have an existing ev scooter or car they will guide you much better yes. since uh, they can't say that uh, no compared to this, this is high and this is negative even i thought uh, the same but only thing is i reached uh, researched a lot in internet and youtube and everything and, and then with your channel i got an assumption like no that is not the thing the thing is the whatever the kilometers and whatever the usage is and how many people will ride the car assume that in your uh, so if you have a uh, home uh, four to five people can drive the car uh, if it is a, mostly is for a city commute on an average if you take a minimum uh, thing without going uh, going to office to drop your children to a, a school and uh, for your groceries and other stuff on an average daily commute would be 10 kilometers yes so for for 10 uh, kilometers assume that what is the mile uh, so uh, the car a uh, petrol car you can assume the mileage would be around 19 or 18 kilometers yes. in city you can't get that so for every hundred rupees you can only uh, get get around uh, 15 max of 15, 15 kilometers uh, in real world range in that was in city traffic so compared to that this is the best car and uh, go ahead and first give it right uh, give it test right and uh, check the features and benefits and other stuff then you would be impressed lot of benefits and features are being given by government as well as Tata as well as other neighborhood just check and then go ahead and decide it's not it's based on your budget requirement and your style of driving you can you can, you can say if your style of driving is petrol you uh, just want to accelerate go 100 or 120 i don't want to waste time then those cars are good for those people if you want good to get uh, you want to save something and invest that amount in somewhere else yeah. or you want to uh, uh, get multiple benefits and you want to show something you want to give something to the environment then this car and that car would be the best Right, okay. And uh, are you thinking any kind of feature is missing in new car? So, uh, one thing is, uh, I have to check the cruise control buttons are there. Uh, yeah, cruise uh, control is there. So, that, then that is the best thing. Mm. And other thing is, uh, they have to also give some uh, charging uh, options. Yeah. If, if Assume that uh, if users uh, want to charge it at any service center or any other, uh, if there's any remote place, they have to give that options and uh, the Tata Connect, Z Connect app is given to that Tigor EV. Mm -hmm. Even uh, if, if any other, I guess in Blow variant, you, got, you don't get that connectivity feature, mm -hmm. but the infotainment system is com good compared to this Nexon. I have seen that, it's very good compared to Nexon. That is good and uh, and even the look and uh, is also no one can uh, uh, see uh, feel that it's a ev car yes <laughs> that is what uh, i i can uh, see that that is the uh, 
good thing of uh, Tata cars. Okay. And the other thing is you are already know it's a four cap and yeah. cap global rated. Yeah. Okay. So it's the safest car. And compared to other cars like uh, in that segment, uh, you don't get much build quality of uh, of that price. Yes. So think about that. Uh, think about safety rather than uh, mileage. That is what my intention is. Yes, and and the last question is on a, a scale of ten, how many points will you give? So I would give nine. a uh, 9 out of 10 okay. since uh, compared to the price uh, compared to that features and everything it's uh, worth of worth a car since if you are if, if compared to my car which is around 16 lakhs yes. and compared to that you can, there's no where i can buy two cars with yes. that so uh, simply go ahead and take that opportunity given by tata and uh, use that first 8000 customers go ahead and book that car as early as possible go and after booking you can test ride it and then you can, if you want to change it then you can go ahead and change that since you you will again miss that opportunity of uh, booking yes. the cars within 8000 mm. within india 8000 is very less very less yes sir. that is what i say and if anyone ask uh, like if anyone ask us about like which car we should need to take like tata nexon ev or tata Nex- i mean tata uh, tiago ev we can tell them that within 16 lakhs of budgets we can actually buy two tata yes. tiago evs yes and mostly features are same See, but the thing range is totally everything range. is same only the the weight would be less uh, it's a compact car and you yeah. can take anywhere uh, this car have some restrictions if mm-hmm. i want to take in lanes but that car has don't have any restrictions okay. and everyone can e- easily drive right okay okay thank you thank you very much mr anand for your uh, valuable welcome. information and feedback sure and That's all for now guys that's all about the opinion on Tata Tiago EV if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and also share this video with your friends and family members for more such videos on electric vehicles please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get instant notifications whenever we upload the videos go green go, go electric, electric.